All right, this is uh, just a quick review of the Topo Athletic ST. And this is a uh, natural style, sort of a minimalist, somewhat minimalist running shoe. Um, and I've been able to do a few runs in it, and I just wanted to give you a short review of what it's like. So far, I really like this shoe a lot. It's got all the features that you would want in a natural style running shoe. Um, and th that is a zero drop. That means the heel is the same as the forefoot. It's extremely flexible, and there's there's a really nice wide toe box, so your toes don't feel crunched at the end like in most normal shoes, um, which allows your toes to kind of spread out and uh, cushion cushion the shock as you're running. Um, it's like I said, it's extremely flexible. I mean, this is not t this is taking barely any pressure at all to bend it, and I like how they have on the arch they they cut out the arch so that there's no arch support underneath and that allows for more elastic recoil from your arch so that's really nice now um, in their original running shoe the RR uh, I actually had a problem with some of the the back the heel cup was a little bit too stiff and it seems like on this new model um, they've kind of fixed that it's a lot softer back here um, the original model was called the RR and it was a split toe design which gives you a little bit more um, flexibility with the big toe. But, you know, I, I started looking at these two and they're pretty similar. Let me see if I can grab a different one here so you can see exactly. They're almost, a, they're pretty much identical except for the split toe. But I noticed that this newer one feels a lot lighter than, than the older one. And I started looking at the older one. It's actually a lot stiffer. This is actually taking quite a bit more pressure to compress this and this new one the ST with the non-split toe it actually is a lot more flexible this is barely taking any uh, pressure at all to flex this so that's a huge improvement I really like that and I put them on my postal scale just to see what the weight was and the older one is actually quite a bit heavier this one it weighed in at about seven and a half ounces for a men's ten and a half and the newer one is six and six and a half ounces so quite a whole ounce of weight reduction and I'm thinking it's probably from this lighter sole um, it's, it's, a, it's a different material it's a little bit spongier a little softer and it, it feels great so I, I'm really liking this shoe so far and uh, I'll continue to update with with you with it as I as I continue to run in it but um, so far it's been a great shoe and I'm really enjoying it